And now to election 2020 and claims of fraud in Fulton County. Well, elections officials held an emergency meeting today to address surveillance video from State Farm Arena that allegedly shows workers counting votes after hours with no supervision. CBS 46's Adam Murphy is live outside State Farm Arena in Atlanta. And uh, Adam, a lot of people have been talking about this video and yet another discussion today. Hey there, Tracy. Fulton County Elections Director Richard Barron said that state investigators with the Secretary of State's office view that surveillance video from with inside State Farm Arena here in downtown Atlanta and determined that there was nothing fraudulent going on. Having said that, though, Barron admitted himself during an early morning call he hadn't seen the video. So let me show it to you. Here it is. Take a look at this surveillance video, which was released yesterday by the president's legal team led by Rudy Giuliani. It was presented to a Senate subcommittee in Georgia claiming it shows people taking out at least four boxes of ballots that were stored underneath the table and they were pulled out after hours. And then that is when counting began on some of these ballots with no election supervisors present. It is believed that each box consisted of about 6,000 ballots or so. So today, well, Fulton County Elections Council. Board member Dr. Kathleen Ruth questioned Elections Director Richard Barron about it and asked who was present during the ballot counting process after 1030 on election night. Were there observers present um, during that 1030 to 11 time period when counting was still going on? No, but I know also that there were no observers there at the time either. There was only media there. Okay, so there were no observers while there were still counting during that that latter part of the evening. No. Now, I reached out to the Secretary of State's office today to ask them about this issue. I requested a one on one interview with the Secretary of State or anyone from the team that was not granted. Now, that being said, Gabe Sterling, the implementation manager with the Secretary of State's office, pushed out a tweet earlier today basically saying that what was happening on that video was, quote, normal ballot processing. I'll stay on top of this one. We're live at the State Farm Arena in Atlanta. Adam Murphy. CBS 46 News. All right, Adam, thanks very much. Important to stress, just because the president's legal team says that there was something fishy going on doesn't mean that there was. But Adam will look into it. He will continue to report on this.